Um, a visual field test is a way to assess a patient's full field of vision, both their central vision as well as their peripheral vision. So we predominantly do it for patients who have a condition called glaucoma. Glaucoma is a condition that affects your optic nerve. And for most patients in the early stages, it affects your peripheral vision. So a visual field test is one of the best ways to be able to assess for that. Um, a lot of patients with conditions that affect their retina, similarly, we will do visual field tests. Um, and also for patients who have certain neurological conditions and issues with their brain, um, either certain tumors or if they have a history of a stroke, we'll also do a visual field test to assess for any losses to that peripheral vision. For most instruments, what that's going to involve is the patient sitting on the instrument and looking at a screen. There's going to be a central dot or fixation point that the patient's going to look at. And as they're focusing on that dot, there's going to be lights that are going to be presented in their peripheral vision. And they're going to have a button that they're going to have to click every time they see one of those peripheral lights. These lights can either be static or kinetic, depending on the needs of the patient and what exactly needs to be tested. As far as preparation, there's very minimal preparation that's required from a patient's perspective. I think one of the things to be mindful of is that you do want to be quite alert when you're doing the test. So it's maybe not something you want to schedule at the end of a long work day. One of the key, key things that a patient needs to be mindful of is just ensuring that they're always looking straight ahead at the fixation point that they're told to look at um, and ensuring they're really just using that peripheral vision to respond to any lights that are presented to them. Um, if a patient does wear glasses, we do recommend that they bring the, their glasses in with them. Um, if they're a contact lens wearer, they could probably do the test with their contact lenses on. So if a patient does miss some points indicating that they, there is some loss of vision in their peripheral vision, depending on the reason and the cause, their doctor will discuss with them what the next steps are. Um, for certain conditions, that loss of vision might be reversible. So it's very likely they will be repeating that visual field test to look for that resolution and improvement. For other conditions, it might be a matter of just monitoring that any sort of loss of vision is stable. So that'll be a discussion that the patient will have with their doctor as far as the next steps.